Hi, I'm Ben. I'm Dustin. Welcome to another edition of JP Enterprise's new product showcase. Let's check out what's new this month. All right, coming into 2020, LRI was the go-to large frame AR-10 setup. It was in uh, magazines, people writing articles about how accurate that was. And we followed that up with a small frame SCI. SCI 20, that's right. Well, you know, take what works and, you know, pass it down through the line. If it makes sense, we're going to continue it out there. And we did see some, some fantastic improvements uh, with the barrel rigidity, so ultimately uh, accuracy, consistency downrange um, in that large frame platform. So we wanted to integrate that into what was the SCR um, and now is the SCI 20 with that semi-monolithic setup for the handguard attachment. So just a much more robust area in that receiver extension where your barrel extension is being mounted. Uh, obviously, the, the more you can make the system as if it were one piece, the better. You know, right. get rid of any of those loose tolerances or any space. So for all of you that haven't watched the video on the LRI, what we're getting at is, is that on the upper receiver where a barrel nut will attach to the upper receiver, there's a lot of movement on some of these rifles that when you get in there, you can actually grab the barrel and hold, put your hand on the handguard, grab the barrel, and you can actually start to flex the barrel around a little bit, which your gas block will hit the handguard, mm -hmm. and that causes a lot of accuracy issues if you are ever put a lot of weight on there. By going to the semi-monolithic setup here, we eliminated a lot of that and made the system a lot more rigid. So we're talking about getting on to bags, shooting uh, prone with a bipod, putting it into a tree and trying to torque over a little bit. We see it happen. A lot of guys will do it in competition, whether they're hunting. You don't always have that perfect shot. And by doing that with both these systems, that helped out a lot. So what, what else we got going on this that is the standard JP features that some people would recognize. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, of course, your non-reciprocating left side charging handle. Worthwhile mentioning on that SCI 20, uh, that's going to only work on, on a matching lower, so that, that SCR 11 type lower. Um, you'll be able to see, now one thing that changed compared to uh, the old SCR 11 was that upper receiver did not have a dust cover or forward assist. We decided on this one, uh, we got really positive feedback and have had some people looking for a dust cover. Still no need for a forward assist on there. Uh, so we did integrate the dust cover assembly in there. And it's actually, it's a great setup where you can you can remove that dust cover uh, very easily without having to, to worry about, you know, obviously you can't take off the handguard uh, or the nut assembly because uh, it's all part of the upper receiver, but easily re remove if you don't need to run a dust cover, you can run it without. Um, but all those features, you know, uh, also you, you'll notice as you get some close looks on this, that it's got that reduced size that you've seen on the, on the new CTR02 uh, upper receiver. Just a little bit of reduced weight, kind of a newer look on them. Um, left side charging handle, you've got your choice, either low profile or that competition left side charging handle, which sticks out off the left more. Um, magnetic retention, which is a great new feature on those. Uh, just a really solid setup. So it's still same sexy JP look in the handguard and in the receiver itself. Uh, just new, new design. It's more rigid, yeah, absolutely. Just one of those features that uh, is, is gonna help in the actual performance that you're, you're getting out of the rifle. Now, once again, I know you, I know you covered this, but for the, everybody at home when he was talking about you have to run the actual lower for this receiver and that's because there is no cutout for the top charger. Uh, this is a, a phenomenal setup. Both of them are actually, if you're gonna run some press because you're not gonna get any blowback in the face. So uh, beautiful for that. Um, getting into long range, any varmint hunting, anything like that, you, you're gonna be set up really nice with some superior accuracy coming out of this. Absolutely. And it's worthwhile mentioning, you can see on here, we've got uh, the signature style Mark III handguard tube versus the rapid configuration Mark III handguard tube. And, and those are both options for that LRI 20 or the, uh, the SCI 20. Those are the type of handguards that will fit on there many different lengths available. You can check that on our website, jprifles.com. Got anything else? You know, I just can't wait to get mine. Yeah, no, I, I think having both of them, having some twins there built out identical, so you can shoot large frame or small frame and you'd be good to go. A yeah, tool for every job. All right. Once again, I'm Ben. And I'm Dustin. Thanks for joining us for this edition of JP Enterprise's new product showcase. Be sure to like, subscribe, follow us on all of our social media platforms, and we'll see you guys at the range.